Can we keep the hot food in the fridge? First of all, there is a food safety question. If you put huge pots of very hot food, think soup or hot jam, then yes, this isn't great for your refrigerator and the other food stored there, as it can bring the temperature of the fridge up to dangerously warm levels. So technically speaking, yes, at times it is not a good idea to put very hot food away, it's best to use a water bath to bring the food to lukewarm temperatures and then put it away. However, we assume that we are hardly talking about huge vats of soup. If you are just talking about small bits of leftovers, then there is a minor quality issue. If you cover and put away food while it is super hot, all that trapped steam makes certain things less nice, it can soften fried coatings, for instance. But this also isn't a big deal, since you are going to refrigerate the food anyway. Ultimately, we probably will have to side with you on this one. In our opinion, it's best to put away leftovers while they are still fresh. Letting them sit at room temperature to cool completely could cause even more bacteria opportunity to grow. Storing hot food in the refrigerator will not damage the refrigerator. It also won't harm the hot food which has probably been adequately sterilized by cooking. It may harm the other food in the refrigerator. That food may have acquired bacteria and could be warmed to an unsafe temperature by warm food next to it. Make sure that even room temperature food is covered. Simply opening the refrigerator door a few times per day in a damp state, like Missouri, can cause enough condensation that the refrigerator ceases to cool and must be manually defrosted. The built-in automatic defrost was not sufficient there and steamy food would have just made that worse. I have not seen this problem since moving to the drier climate of Colorado. It's best not to. You don't want that hot dish heating up everything else in the fridge. One thing about refrigerators, they are insulated and they are very efficient, meaning they provide just a little cooling. It's enough to keep food cold and handle a reasonable amount of door openings, but there's not a lot of reserve cooling. Throw in a big hot baking dish of lasagna, it takes a long time for the fridge to counteract that much heat. Best thing to do is let the food cool down for up to two hours and then put it in the fridge. If the shelves and racks are not affected by the heat of the vessel, the food gets cooled faster than what it would if it was kept outside but the compressor runs for longer time because the temperature inside the fridge raises temporarily above the set temperature. Your electricity bill would go up considerably if you do this often and your compressor life may get adversely affected. So, it is better not to do that regularly. Occasional mistakes are forgiven by the refrigerator. Sure, and the risks are negligible, but it's still not a good idea. If you put it in a sealed container, the water vapor coming off the hot food will condense on the cold surface of container. If you wait until it cools a bit, you won't get so much so your food will stay moist. Best to let it cool to room temperature, not too long, and then put it in the refrigerator you cut and it would cool down the food more quickly but in the meantime it would raise the temperature inside the fridge above the correct storage temperature for any other food in the fridge thereby shortening the safe storage period and possibly increasing the likelihood of food poisoning. Tease fine to place hot food directly in the refrigerator. Don't worry about overheating the fridge as the it's fine to place hot food directly in the refrigerator. Don't worry about overheating the fridge as the U. S. Department of Agriculture points out, the refrigerator's thermostat will keep it running to maintain a safe temperature of 40 degrees Fahrenheit or below. What you do need to worry about is whether the hot food will cool off quickly enough to reach a safe temperature once it's in the refrigerator. So never put deep containers of hot food in the refrigerator instead, place the hot food in shallow containers so it will chill quickly. A large pot of soup or stew, for instance, should be divided into smaller portions and placed in smaller containers before being refrigerated. A large cut of meat or whole poultry should be divided into smaller pieces and wrapped separately or placed in shallow containers before refrigerating. If you prefer, you can also quick chill the food in an ice water bath before refrigerating it.